This is the solution to written homework one. It says find the equation of the tangent line. Well, to find any line, you need a point and a slope. So as for the point, we're given that x is equal to 0. And then to determine y, we plug x is equal to 0 and to y is e to x. So y is e to 0, which is 1. So the point is x1, y1 equal to 0, 1. The slope will be the derivative evaluated at x is 0. So dy dx is the derivative of e to x. The derivative of e to x is e to x, and then we evaluate this at x is equal to 0, tells us that the slope m is equal to 1. <coughs> then we can plug this into the point-slope form of a line. y minus y1 is m multiplied by x minus x1. So y minus 1 is m multiplied by x minus 0. Oops, that should say 1, because m is 1, times x minus 0. And then solving, <coughs> that is y is equal to x plus 1, moving the 1 to the other side. So that's the answer to part A. Part B is just the same, except for a slightly different exponential. The point will be the same, because we're given that x is 0, and then y will be <coughs> 2 to 0, which is 1. So that means the point x1, y1 is 0, 1. And then the slope, the slope will be different. <coughs> dy dx is the derivative of 2 to x. And then, recalling the rule stated above, <coughs> that is 2 to x multiplied by the natural logarithm of 2. And then the slope is what you get when you plug in uh, x is 0. So the slope is 2 to 0 times the log of 2, which is just the log of 2. So for in part a, the slope was 1. In part b, the slope is the logarithm of 2. So again, now we have y minus y1 is m x minus x1. So y minus 1 is logarithm of 2 <coughs> multiplied by x minus 0. <coughs> Solving, that yields y is the logarithm of 2 multiplied by uh, x and then plus 1. So what this is saying <coughs> is that this is the slope and this is the y-intercept. And notably, if you plug it into your calculator, <coughs> the logarithm of 2 Logarithm of 2 is about 0 0.69, which means that this uh, tangent line has slope less than 1. So this one has slope exactly 1, this one has slope less than 1, and now we're going to show that this one, 3 to x, has slope greater than 1. 
So again, the point. <clears throat> X is 0, and Y is what you get when you plug in 0, which is again 1. So the point X1, Y1 <clears throat> is 0, 1. The slope, compute the derivative. which is 3 to x multiplied by the logarithm of 3. And then you plug in x is 0 to find the slope of the tangent line there. <coughs> that is 3 to 0 multiplied by the logarithm of 3, which is the logarithm of 3. <coughs> and you plug this in, y minus y1, is m multiplied by x minus x1. So y minus 1 is the logarithm of 3 multiplied by x minus 0. And then solving, <coughs> y is the logarithm of 3 times x and then plus 1. <coughs> Well, again, this is the slope. And this is the y-intercept. And note that the logarithm of 3, according to the calculator, is about 1.0, about 1.1. So 1.0986. So that means that these three different exponentials, their tangent lines all go to the same point. They all go to the point 0, 1 but with slightly different slopes. This one goes through with slope 1, this one with slope a little less than 1, and this one with slope a little more than 1.